so yeah kind of just uh struggling a little you know i uh i don't know i've kind of hit a wall i guess you could say i don't really know what to post i'm going to be completely honest with y'all i mean i know i should be posting uh stuff i should be working on my projects that i've been talking about and kind of boasting about and stuff like that but i don't know i just there's something about it you know i guess i'm sort of struggling to uh find not necessarily a motivation eh. i guess i'm procrastinating i guess you could say i just part of me is like why do i really want to dump this amount of work into uh such a project and then turns out i don't have the resources to do said project or i want to do really cool things but i just don't have the proper gear in order to do it and i don't know like i want to do some short stories i want to do like some short story series or i don't know some recording stuff i know i just i don't have the creative mind to continuously make videos that uh are fresh and new i don't know i just it sucks that i'm not interested in a lot of stuff lately that um I really can't make videos about them or I could come up with an idea and I just don't know how to, you know, make that out of a video or it turns out to be 40 minutes of recording and then I get halfway through editing and I'm like, this is monotonous. This is just not something that I want to keep editing or I'm not happy with the product and I don't want to re-record it. So I just scrap it. There's been quite a few ideas that I've done that I've scrapped and, you know, just kind of sucks. I mean, a lot of things are kind of popping up as well. I mean, I just graduated, got home. And I guess it's the fourth now at the time of this recording. I guess you could say yesterday I graduated. I got my diploma. So that's cool. I, uh happy about that and on my way to college here in a few months and maybe my creative mind will pop up I'll have some people to give me some insights I'll maybe have the technology or the resources to do it but at the moment kind of just stuck I mean I start work next Monday I don't know how often we're going to be working either um so I might not have time to even make videos which sucks I guess I'm just stuck in the mentality. I know I need to post more and I know it's not going to come overnight, but I'm kind of stuck with that mentality of putting work into a video that's not really seen. And I don't know. I just don't like doing stuff that didn't satisfy my time, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if that can be considered selfish in a way because, I mean... I'm more the type of person where I like to do a project and then I like to see how people like it. I like it when people enjoy what I do. It makes me feel like I did something right and it makes me feel that I can actually make something, that I can actually do something that people enjoy. I don't really do a whole lot of that, at least not lately. I haven't been able to do something and everyone's just like, wow, that's pretty cool. I don't know. I just want to be known for doing something good, you know? I mean, there's stuff with, I don't know. I don't know. Kind of just struggling. I don't know. I say that a lot. I don't know. But that's really I that's how I feel. I just don't know. I don't understand why I don't have the creative drive anymore to create videos. It's there one minute, gone the next. I don't understand it. I don't know why I just sometimes just don't care about it. Like 
these projects could be really cool. And I understand if I take the time and the effort, they could be something great. And I know this channel could be something amazing. I was on a straight month hot streak and we went from like 100 to 236 subscribers. And I saw like a future there, but then for some reason my mind just gone. I don't know. Cause it just didn't care. And I, it sucks cause I do care, but I physically just don't have the, I don't know. I guess I just feel tired mentally all the time and it fogs my brain and keeps me from doing things I want to do and it sucks. But I just don't, I don't know. I don't know what to say. It's difficult to put it into words, I guess. It's just, I don't know. I don't know if those projects, I'm going to be honest, I don't know if they're ever going to come out. I know people got excited for them, maybe started talking about them and all that, but I just, I don't know. I don't, I don't feel like I can find the right motivation to do it. I don't know. Maybe I'm just lazy. It's possible. Maybe it just... Uh, this video feels like it's just gonna be like a silent just me saying I don't know every five seconds which oh well but kind of just wanted to get my feelings out on camera you know I don't know I feel like this this is fine like I like being in front of a camera this is great like I enjoy doing this and I enjoy talking it's just I don't know I guess you could say I got wrapped up in the the fucking numbers. Yeah. But I mean it's hard cuz I'm not going to produce something and then it just gets a bunch of hate cuz like what's the point of me putting it on my platform or on my channel if people are just going to hate it? It's like I kind of have to pay attention to the numbers, but at the same time I guess it's just me getting mentally stuck in this whole thing of you need to get subscribers, you need to get views, you need to grow. And I mean, like, yeah, that's cool. But like, I'm part of me thinks that's partially hindering me on what I should be doing, which is creating what I like and what I want to do. But I guess I just don't have the time, proper time management. I don't manage my time well enough to do that sort of stuff. I also give up on things really fast. I just, I don't know how to fix that because I don't know what it is. I could really get into something, but after a while and I realize it's going to take a long time for something to actually get done, I lose interest so fast. I get bored. I don't care anymore about what it was I was working on and it, it doesn't help at all. It ruins projects. I guess you could say, I guess when ti when things get tough, I don't end up, you know, figuring it out, which sucks. The audio is probably too loud. I don't care. But yeah, it's, it's tough, you know. I'm probably not even going to edit this video. It's just going to be one long, like, thing, you know. I just want to, I want to get into a lot of stuff. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I don't, I guess I should just lay it out. I want to do things. I want to do short films. I want to work with people to create cool things. I want to get into animations like voice acting in them. Voice acting has been something that I found to be really cool. Because I like the idea of being able to do something unique, having your own voice in a big project and everyone coming together to build something cool and then everyone gets to enjoy it. And then I watch all these people who try to imitate or learn the uh, voices of a certain character in like a movie or cartoon and I just find that cool because I like that little interaction, like your voice is something that the fans can interact with and try to learn and it's honestly just something that I've found cool. Not only that, but people just enjoying it in general. I like it when people enjoy 
what I put out. I don't like it when people don't like what I put out. I feel bad. Whenever I see a bunch of dislikes on a video, I'm like, what did I do wrong there? I guess, I guess it just wasn't a good video, and I don't know. I want to, yeah, voice acting is, I guess it sucks because when I think of voice acting, I think that is such, there's so many people who probably want to do that, that it'd be very, very tough to do something like that in such a competitive space. At the same time, it's also one of those hobbies where not everyone can do it. Like sometimes there's just people who just can't do it. I mean, yeah, there's learning, but some people just don't have what it takes to do it. Like me and soccer or like any sport, sure, maybe I could get fit, but sometimes I might just not be good at it. I play Valorant all the time, every day. And I'm just stuck in the same rank, so maybe I'm just not good at it, you know? It's kind of one of those things where it's a mental barrier. Like, I don't want to waste what could potentially be years focusing on voice acting, and then turns out that's not something I can do. It's just not going anywhere. And then I feel like I wasted valuable time when I could be using it for something else. It's like, I don't want to work on short films or stuff like that, or this audio series I was talking about. And then turns out I didn't like it or it's, that was weird. Is that my foot? Okay. That was my arm. Okay. Cause right here in the corner, right down here, I scared myself. I thought something moved, but anyways, I don't want to work on these projects. And then turns out they weren't good or I just give up, you know? it's a struggle it's a hard struggle I want to make videos well you fuck off OneDrive you can go delete yourself uh, that's probably being heard in the video but guess what I'm not editing it out fuck you I don't know it's a struggle, you know, so many things I want to do and I want it done right. And I want it to look good. Am I too close to my mic? I don't care. I mean, it's just, I want to do, I want to do it right. And I want to do it well. And I want it to look good. That's my problem. I don't, I mentally cannot settle for good enough. I want it to, I want it to look good. I want it to sound good. I want it all to be good. And I just don't seem to have the patience to do something like that. And it sucks. I don't have the patience for a lot of things. That also sucks. I guess you could say I work better with people. The more people I have with it dedicated to working on it daily, then yeah, I'd be glad to devote my time daily to working on something with a group. But the problem is, I don't know people who can daily agree to work on something like that, let alone for free daily. And I'm talking like every day, just like dedicate a few hours to go work on it or something, work on the project. I also don't know anyone interested in doing something like that. And to be honest with you, I don't know. It might just not be something that's just possible with a group anyways. Or maybe it doesn't matter and working with a group still wouldn't boost my motivation, you know? And you'd probably be like, oh, hey, I'd be a voice actor. And it's like, yeah, I get that. But I still don't have... It's been like a month since I last worked on storyboarding for the actual audio series. I literally only have storyboards and concepts of prologue episode one and episode two. I only have three like episodes or videos uh, storyboarded. So and I'm planning for this to be like a six, seven episode thing. That's including, that's not including the prologue. The prologue would be considered like episode eight if it's seven total episodes. So I don't know. I'm just trying to 
figure it out because I also have to fit the story well enough to fit in that many episodes. I don't want it to be too many. I also have to calculate and make sure that the video is long enough to be considered an episode. I don't know. I want to do a lot of things. I guess I'm just mentally stuck, like I said. Uh, I don't feel like I have the right equipment, like this camera. Like, Sure, I figured out a way to make it look a lot smoother than what my videos normally are, but at the same time, it's just blurry. It's all you see is just blur. There's no cinematic, clear crispness to but crispness to it. And honestly, I don't really have the money to be spending on getting a new camera. I want a better. I mean, this mic's pretty good, but I want a better one. I want one that doesn't have echo in a room. Um, I want proper lighting. I want. I mean, I do have proper lighting. I guess you could say. I just don't have a proper way of filming stuff i don't know i guess maybe this is all me problems but i just felt like talking about it you know because we're struggling yeah i guess that's really about it i don't know what else I can really say without beating a horse or whatever the saying is beating a dead horse it's I don't know yeah I could literally just sit here in front of everyone and be bored but that would extend the length of the video and no one wants to watch someone sit around so if you watched this and you made it through for some reason, which I doubt anyone really did, uh, why, I guess. Also, thank you for listening to my struggles. Uh, I don't know. It sucks. It's tough. I know I could make a good channel. I know I can make good content. People tell me I make good content. I just mentally can't do it. I don't know what it is. I mentally just can't stick to it. And I can't fucking focus on it. I need to focus. I need to consistently upload. But it's tiring. And it's also tough not knowing what I'm doing half the time. I want to make funny edits. I want to do all this. But it's just hard. Because it's stuff you have to learn. And that takes time. And when you take time... You save less time for other things, and then you feel like you're wasting time learning this thing. You know what I mean? I feel like I'm wasting time by spending time learning something, and I'm wasting time for other things, because it might just be a waste of time in the end, and I learned it all for nothing. I'm in that dilemma. It's it's stupid. It sucks. I don't know what to do, you know? That's it. I really don't have anything else. This is literally going to get posted within like literally two minutes, five minutes. I don't know. And yeah, it's not going to be edited because I don't care. I don't really feel like editing it. And I wanted to just get my raw emotions out, not just love behind the scenes, taking out everything. I just want to throw out what I had to say. So thank you if you stuck to the end. No. You know what? I think that that's what I need to do. One video idea. I know. I said I was going to end. Fuck that. Um, one video idea I really wanted to do was... um. I wanted to sort of practice on like voice acting slash acting stuff. Maybe do story things. Like I want to do stories. Like for example... If you watch ASMR, this is not going to be ASMR videos by any means, but if you watch ASMR, you know some ASMR artists, they like to make stories out of what they're doing, and it's really cool what they do. Uh, Eph Ephemeral Rift, he does really good um, stories with his uh, ASMRs. A lot of people do really good, uh, I think Matt ASMR, whatever his name is. He does really good ASMR videos, and uh, not just ASMR, but, like, the storytelling aspect to it. And I just want to make videos practicing, like, either voice act, like voice acting or um, acting in general, and then turn it into a story. 
because I like to write stories. So it's just something that I enjoy doing on the side is writing a story. So maybe I'll start posting those. Um, I need to start posting less, I think. I mean, I'm already not posting a lot. I'm just barely throwing a YouTube short that I when I made a wimpy TikTok every now and then. But I need to upload less, but I need to put out better content, I suppose you could say. So, yeah, that's my last minute thing to throw out. I know I've said last minute thing like five times now, but deal with it. If you're still here, I guess you really didn't care um, that I rambled on or said screw you and stuff, but uh, love you. Yeah, that's about it. If I don't end recording now, it's not going to end. So thank you for sticking around and see ya. That didn't end.